Alrighty, everyone, welcome back to Grand Theft Auto V. It's been a little while, but now we're going to be focusing more on GTA V as uh, we head into the second half, right? We're actually right at the point of the game where I believe we're actually heading into the second half of it. Um, so with Trevor, which we, we basically want to finish up his missions at this point, we've got <clears throat> this FIB mission, and then we've got his heist. I don't remember what these are, so I almost feel like we should do the FIB mission tonight. Or, and, uh, and see, you know, do that first, get out of the way. If I believe if we do his heist, that moves us into the next portion of the major story of the game. So, I think that's what we'll do, unless anyone else has a recommendation. Okay? I think that's what we should do. I don't remember what this FIB mission is, though. I'm trying to remember. Man, every time I boot this game up, I start driving. I'm like, oh my god, it looks so good, right? I'm going the wrong way, by the way. The 60 frames look so impressive. Here, I got up my volume on my headphones here. All right. <clears throat> Still too low. Now it sounds a little better. Here we go. All right. Hello, Ghost. How are you today? Welcome, everyone. A lot of people joining the stream now that we've actually gotten into the gameplay portion. Welcome to everyone joining me for GTA 5. <laughs> Stupid Mini Cooper. <clears throat> whoa, whoa, whoa. What's going on here? This crazy guy smacking the shit out of his girlfriend. I don't know what to do. I think he's gonna kill her. Yeah? What do we do? <clears throat> Come on, quick! This way! She was screaming no! And he just kept hitting her! It's just over here! Could this be some kind of a trick? This is we got one! Go, go, get in there! You it is a trick. Are you kidding me? What a bunch of idiots. That was the worst ambush in history. What a bunch of fucking morons. Right? Like, <laughs> we didn't really get much out of it, though. <laughs> Kicks her in her fat ass. Alright, fuck you, bitch. Try to get me killed. That was so dumb. That was like the stupidest mission ever. Alright, where's the car now? Uh, where is the car now? Wait a minute. There it is. I was like, where's the Mini Cooper? There it is. Okay. All your friends are dead. You deserve a kick in your big butt. There you go. Take that, stupid. All right, let's continue. <laughs> Little distraction there. It happens sometimes in this game, but you know, move on. Fuck that. Like people, like they're really gonna get the once over on Trevor of all people. Yeah, right. He's the one who gets the once over on you. I wouldn't be surprised if he set that whole thing up to begin with. Fuck is this? We handled your little immigration problem, whatever the fuck it was. We're straight. Oh, absolutely. Yeah, yeah. You killed people, you tortured... Here's Trevor. Get your raid! Looky, looky, huh? A bunch of government shitbags and their favorite stoolers. Uh... What's he been telling you? Oh, he just said how you guys were happy to help the government in any way you can. Yeah, right. Oh, really? Huh? Because I was told that if we helped out with that thing, which we did, then our past indiscretions would be forgotten in a haze of patriotic fervor. Who told you that? Did I tell you that? I'm in charge here, Fruity. Me! You understand? Uh, not quite. <laughs> Can you explain that again? What I was saying! <laughs> oh, you're good. The three cunts. Listen, we need help with something else. Some of the government 
Some of it is pretty corrupt. Nah! <laughs> see no evil, speak no evil, speak no evil, right? no evil, hear no yes, evil. Yes, but we're corrupt in a good way. But the agency, they want to encourage panic so they can guarantee their budgets. That's how they get paid. It's a major problem. And now they've secured some funds that we need to use in our fight against crime as a way of bribing corrupt officials. Really? And where are they getting that from? Drugs. Those bastards love to sell drugs. Who doesn't? We think they're going to use this money to finance a war on our streets. And we need you boys to requisition that money for us. The bonds are leaving the terminal in an armored car. Yeah, fuck you, Dave. We don't have time to prepare the right way. <laughs> it's not my concern. I cannot allocate any more resources to this. You'll be fine. Fuck you, Dave. Nice work, Slick. We're gonna be doing pat-downs at the airport before those fucking clowns are done with us. You know, fuck you. Hey, hey, look, man. It is what it is. Now, how the fuck we gonna get this done? I don't know. I got it. Classic blitz play. It's an industrial area, right? So I'm thinking vehicles. Trash truck to block, tow truck sack them. Get some disguises, and we're golden. We just gotta hope like hell these are the kind of agency men that don't carry a panic button with them. If they are, we deal with it. If and when. If and motherfucking when. I will keep my eyes peeled, General! Look. Thank you, Michael. Hey, no problem. <laughs> no, really. Why would they thank you? You're the one who got them into this mess, right? Seriously. Soggy says in the first run I did three little pigs for the disguises. Oh, I don't remember this. I don't remember this mission at all. I've completely forgotten this, this part of the game. Like I said, I only remember like the first third of the game, so everything from now on is just gonna feel almost completely new to me, I bet. <clears throat> I don't remember this, so... So that's just the setup. We don't have to do the mission yet. Okay. All right, guys, a few more details. We'll need boiler suits and masks for this job. The garbage truck. Let's get one from your park. Bring it back to the lot. And there's an auto repair place by the airport where we can get a tow truck. What else? Uh, oh, yeah, 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 get away. That would be nice. Get something fast and discreet. We park it off the road a good distance from the lot. And make sure it ain't near something we'll crash into driving off. That's it. All right, man, I got you, dog. What? Huh? I missed that. Maybe shout a little louder? Fight me. Set of tasks are available. There they are. Okay. So now we have to do those. We can't do... No, we could do his heist. Yeah, we can. We can actually do his heist, too. See? And I think we should do that. I think we should do his heist first. Because if I remember correctly, doesn't this advance you to the next part? I don't remember. Maybe we'll do the Trevor heist first to try to make some money. Hmm. Everything's a Trevor mission right now, by the way. Like, literally everything. <laughs> right? Okay. Alright. I think we'll do this first. I think we'll do the, the Trevor heist first. Then we'll do the FIB. And that, if I remember... Will get me into the the next major part of the game, like the next story arc, right? So let's get this going. What's cool now is you can see these buildings off the distance. You remember in San Andreas, the draw distance wasn't good enough to see that stuff over there, but they changed it in this one with the extended draw distance. You can see all that out there now, right? Lucky miss. Beastbot says the Trevor Heist will not give you money. I mean, I'm not out for money. I know it's just a major part of the the, the game. Right? And I get the feeling I'm never going to get anything out of the investment I did earlier. I'm going to lose all my money that I invested in the stock market. It was a horrible idea. Oh, it's this now. Oh, it's the armored car thing. All right. I've driven, I've driven to this thing a million times, and I keep thinking it's something... All you got to do is steal it for money, right? That's all that that is. I think so. That's all that that is, is you steal the armor car and make some money. Yeah, I know. Daniel said you were supposed to invest before you did the assassination. I know, but I didn't know that. Remember, I didn't invest at all in my first playthrough. I didn't understand that part of the game. And then you guys explained it to me, but it was too late. Okay, well, what am I going to do now? I didn't know that. 
You either blow the door open or you steal the truck. That's how you do that armored car. Uh, passed it quite a bunch. All right. Well, let's let's head over to the headquarters. Probably will, if I can, I'll change his, his outfit too. If they let me. I don't know if they're gonna let me before their commission initiates. Ah, Thank God for their extra durable, character-specific vehicles. Went the wrong way. Fuck out! Oh, I gotta get my eyes checked. Okay. Is it you park across the street? This is the lot where you can park your cars, I think, right? Shit. Great parking job. All right. <clears throat> you guys saw nothing. You hear me? Whoa. You need to find Pete, bro. Went the wrong way. All right. Bitw awesome says you're supposed to invest, sleep, and, and wake up right away, and then you hit you make the money. What happened there? I didn't mean to do that. <clears throat> Wait, Floyd. Hey, you guys. I'm expecting company. All right. I want this place clean. Wade, you tidy. Floyd, massage. Uh, no, no, I really don't. Oh, do you want me to get my dick out again? No, no, huh? no, no. Does anyone want that? No, no. You're right. You're right. You're... Hey, bro. What's up? Oh, hey, bro. You're late. Nine years fucking late. You know, you're so late, in fact, that you have no right to call me. Bro, is that clear? Uh, shut the fuck up. You're like a broken fucking record. Oh, yeah? Well, you're like a shit. Exactly like a shit. Where's the assistant? On his way. <sighs> Idolized. This is weird because they're acting like the FIB thing didn't happen. Yo, Frankie, we were just talking about you. Ah, oh, nattering. You know how it is. Yeah, whatever, man. So what are we doing here? We're working, amigo. Taking a score. Yeah, done most of the planning, and uh, I think we're gonna literally make out like bandits on this. Did you talk to Lester? Yeah, yeah, I called him. It's, apparently he's in the hospital having his vagina cleaned or some shit. Got a wasting disease. Twenty percent saved. No, that's not how we work. Well, you'll forgive me, but that's how we're gonna work this time, all right? We're doing it my way, because as I recall the last time when we did it your way, we all got shot at, you got buried, resurrected, turned into a twat, and Brad ended up in a fucking prison! Yeah, and Lester told us not to do that job, but we did it anyway. And Lester seems pretty good, man. <laughs> Would you shut the fuck up, all right? And you, Michael, owe me. Right? So this time, we do things my way. <laughs> yeah, and what about after this? After this, we think about things. So what's the plan? Easy. We are sinking a freighter into Los Santos Harbor. All right? Now, Daddy's little helper, you're going to be on the bridge. All right? You're the lookout. Now, you, you're boarding the freighter and planting charges. Me, I'm running the deep water salvage operation with a little help from my friends. Mm -mm. You mm. Batman, of course, well, you're not one of those friends. Which part is easy, though? Oh, for fuck. Where'd you get the pussy, Mikey? Man, fuck you. Ah, better. I like that. Fuck you. Good. Good. All right, now let's go make some money, ladies, huh? Brilliant. Don't be a dick. Oh, your wish is my commando, master. Let's go, Junior. Hey, Wade, get Michael a wetsuit, or I take him to the boat. Oh. Hurry it up. We're gonna we do need it. some transport, <clears throat> don't we? No formal planning. I'm Let's coming, just do man. it. <clears throat> so I can't change my outfit. They didn't let me. You notice that? I can't even go back in and do it, can I? What's going on? They won't let me. I'm screwed. They won't let me change my outfit. Wow. That's annoying. <laughs> That's so annoying. Oh, yeah, look. Live, laugh, live, love, laugh, eat shit, and die. Very nice. It's pretty appropriate. All right, so you guys, bat. The chat had crashed. This has been happening on YouTube from time to time where the chat will not work for like a minute or two. And then all of a sudden it'll come back. Get in a vehicle. It's back now, right? Okay. Abdullah says Street Fighter 6 streams are addicting. Indeed. Indeed. We'll have one tonight. We'll have one tomorrow. 
Street Fighter 6 is good. I love the game. And, uh, gotta get back into it tonight, right? <clears throat> okay. <clears throat> I'm dropping you on the Port City side of the Miriam Turner overpass, aight? Almost forgot. Here's the rifle with a the thermal scope. Almost forgot. I was kind of sold on, like, a well-organized job, planned out, with Lester's weird eye for details. <laughs> I got an eye for details, kid. Little details like your brick of blow being drywall. Uh, okay, man. I'm grateful for that, dog. But, but buying cocaine is a whole different thing from sinking a container ship into a harbor. Uh, not really, kid. It's all about what's inside. Cool. So, what's the thing, man? I don't know what it is, but I know it's important. You heard of Merriweather? Uh, yeah, maybe. Merriweather Security Consulting, the company our government uses to fight its wars and protect its shady interests all over the planet. They're the army? They're like the army, only they're private, so they cost more. Anyway, they've just been cleared to take government contracts on U.S. soil, and what's one of the first on the list? This container at the port? Exactly, mundo! So it's gotta be valuable, right? Anyway, it doesn't matter, because your job is not to understand, it's to shoot at people who try to stop us. Look the fuck out! Alright. You guys back? Why does YouTube chat suck? Because YouTube chat is not a real chat room. It's a comment on a video, essentially. It's, you know, on Twitch, the chat is IRC chat. <clears throat> and IRC chat is an actual chat client Stop that has all these features. The this does here. not have that Get at up, all. Find your spot on the side of the bridge and call Michael. Okay, man, sure. So basically, I'm in the wrong spot because the GPS is terrible. They have me drive to the overpass, and I'm supposed to be on the underside. Yep. Oh, that's really useful, you stupid game. Wow. I'm pretty sure I was supposed to be on the underside, right? Or not? Am I actually supposed to go up there? I guess we'll try it from the other side of the bridge then. And see if that's correct. If not, the GPS is wrong. I guess we'll find out. <coughs> Oh, uh, no, the, I use OBS. I've used OBS forever. Before OBS, I used one that was called, um... Oh, God, I can't even remember what it was called. It was one you had to pay for. This one's free. But OBS isn't without its problems. Okay, here it is. There we go. Go to the vantage point. All right. Shit. Hey, dog, I'm in position. Let me know when you're ready. All right, F, I'm in position. Damn, that's a long way up. So make sure I don't run into any trouble when I get there. Fucking Trevor. All right, I got you, homie. X split, yeah, that's what I used. X split. Hey, yo, there's two guards. These are bad dudes, right? I read up about these fools online. Yeah, they're a nasty bunch. Two for one. It's clear, man. Climb aboard. Things I do for old friends. I got four bombs to plant, kid. Look out for me while I do it. There's some serious manpower on this ship. Oh, going right here? Hey, ain't you gonna set up that bomb? I guess right here? This isn't a pillar. What do they mean by a pillar? I guess this is it. How do I do it? How do I set it up? I don't know how to do it. There we go. First bomb is planted okay. and armed. I'm moving up to the next position. Oh, Abdullah, I don't know. I've never used the bat top. 
on a modern arcade stick with Japanese style controls. I used to have the bat top on American style joysticks back in the day, but I don't know how they would work for Japanese. I can do it quick or I can do it right, okay? Wait, is that Michael? Why? Is that seriously Michael? That was Michael the whole time. They gave you aim on Michael. And you didn't... You... <laughs> There was no way to see that guard either. It was impossible. Hey, if this is Trevor's thing, why ain't he doing any other wet work? Cuz he's screwing around in a submarine. I don't know how we got roped into this shit. Okay, much better. Looks clear. Rig the bomb. Third charge is set. I gotta go inside for the last one. Come to the south side. I'll clear the entrance for you. It says there's one more, but I don't see him. Oh, there he is. Or is that Michael? That's Michael. Here's the door. Okay. Going in. Get back to where I can see you as soon as you can. I'm not gonna screw around in here, all right? Just tell me when you planted it. Oh shit. Are you okay, man? You gotta go. The alarm's gone, man. You okay? Shot that guy in the dick. shot on these guys. The pain. charges. Detonate. Alright. Now 
Not so tough, just a bunch of sniping basically. Pretty pretty straightforward, pretty easy. dive? How the fuck do I dive? How do I dive? Uh, I don't know why I surfaced and I don't know how to dive. Look. What fucking button is dive? <laughs> I think it's right here. There's a light. It must be it. He's in the sub. The subby stall. Okay, incoming. Real lights. Turn your goddamn lights. Gets you shit. No underwater lights at all. Hey, what is this thing? It looks kind of sinister. If we knew what it was, it wouldn't be top secret or very valuable, would it? It ain't doing anything to the water, is it? I'm swimming around in this. Well, it could give you powers. Turn you into infinite rage? Ha <laughs> nah. Just take a shower after, you'll be fine. Ah, how did I let myself get talked into this? There it is. I'm grabbing it. Hey, go easy with that thing. Don't tell me what it can do. What is it? I, I can't see. So There's no light and I can't see. Did I get it? Yeah. I guess I got it. I couldn't even tell. Seems meeting at Pier 400 for a debrief. Beers are on me. I'll stay for one. That's what you always say. Yeah, well, I mean it now. Floyd, come in. I got the package. Can't see shit. It's so I dark. The <laughs> There's no lights. I'm here. I heard gunshots and explosions. Keep it together. I'll be there soon. Why the hell is it so goddamn dark, right? There's no, no lights on this sub. To see shit underwater. It's like super darkness. It's freaking me out. I don't want to be down there in the dark. Turn on the lights. Ugh. This is a scary place, man. Right or left on the D-pad? Nope. Nope. Oh. Wait, the lights were supposed to be on and they were glitched. Because you saw that the lights were on but there was no light around the sub. So the lighting was completely glitched. Now it's working. <laughs> wow. That's Don't interesting. Now I'm stuck. How the fuck do I just turn it off? Here. <clears throat> Survived the ship going down, so I can probably knock it around, right? Floyd, I'm coming in. Get the crane ready. Look how clearly defined that ring is. Everything else is blurry. Pull me up. Pull me up. There's no one pulling me up. What are you talking about? There we go. Weird. So they have no idea what they have. You want about Trevor, but she, he got it done. Yep, let's hope so. Hey, is that an Aston? What? Hey, man, what the fuck you doing here? You should be in bed. Yes, I should be. I would be if certain known associates were busy making themselves enemies of the state. You know, the FIB, Merriweather, IAA. You could fuck with them all day long. But 
When you try and steal an experimental super weapon and sell it to the Chinese, you and everyone you ever knew is gonna be fucked in the ass, you fucking chumps! Uh, hold on, man. A super weapon? The Chinese? What? <laughs> what do you think is in there? I thought he talked to you. All right, man. So what now? Well, maybe I can organize to have it taken back and found amongst the wreckage. Whoa! Holy fuck, Lester Crest! Holding on and looking good, huh? Do you have any idea what you did here? Yeah? I pulled a score. <laughs> what are you jealous because you didn't get your 20%? If that thing doesn't go back, then we will all end up on every watch list in the entire planet. Watch list? So fucking watch! So they don't watch, they kill. Idiot, we'll all be dead within a week. Think! Listen. Oops. Take the truck, take a guy, do what you gotta do. Trevor? I'll load it up. Uh, Trevor? Great. Then you and the patient can take it all back. Right fucking now! Nice view. So you mean to tell me this shit was all for nothing? Man, it's the hood all over again. Fuck. Come on, Franklin. You owe me, Michael. I am owed. What you gonna do, huh? I think it's something. I gotta get Franklin some work, too. Yeah, yeah. Lots of mouths to feed, amigo. Tell me about it. Fuck! I mean, that was pretty stupid. He didn't actually plan anything properly, right? So look, take 20 million, lost 20 million. And <clears throat> no one gets any cut. I was supposed to get... 12 headshots. I don't know what Ninja 9 is. Or Container Hunter. I guess you're supposed to get the container faster or something. Right? <clears throat> huh. Hide a vehicle in a discreet location and use as a getaway vehicle. Oh, so now... Okay. So we finished that. We just got an achievement. Yeah, submersive. Look at that. <clears throat> you stole an experimental... Submersible for Meriwether, then gave it back. What an amazing mission. What a waste of time, huh? Right? <laughs> Guys, remember, we still need to set up a getaway car. Find one, leave it somewhere secluded, then call the others to say where it is. That's the next part. Okay. Alright, where am I going now? Well... That all we have left is this. That's it. Yep. Okay. <clears throat> so, we have to do this next heist. Even though it's not a heist, this one is for FIB, right? So, we're stuck now. <laughs> okay. Let's, uh, let's do it then. We need a vehicle. We're going the wrong way, by the way. We need a vehicle. Get the hell out of here. We're going the wrong way. We're heading towards the water. I don't like these docks. These docks are all dead ends. You get stuck walking around on them, right? I mean, I do like the rain effects right now. Look how cool that looks, right? <clears throat> the rain effects look awesome. Let's get out to the street. The... O'Neal. Ah, brother O'Neal. Fuck you, man. Whoa, whoa, whoa. You're the guy stealing contracts. You burnt a farm, killed my brothers. Oh my God! You so had too the game. many brothers. So of his they needed cutting. You're fucking dead, aren't we all? We live and we die. That's our curse. Hey, you want to expedite the situation? Come fucking find me. Vespucci Beach, Los Santos. You inbred hillbilly fuck. I'll be there, man. I don't know when, but I'll be there. That's that's weird that that comes up out of nowhere. Like you you killed his whole family how many hours ago when you were first introduced to, to Trevor, right? That was like the first thing you did. And now all of a sudden that's coming up now, like way later. <laughs> all right. Well, let's uh. Start doing the setup for this next major mission. So I guess once you do both of these heists, even though technically they're not really heists, then uh, you're probably advancing to the next part of the story, if I remember correctly. But I don't really remember. Again, I, I I really don't remember this part of the game. 
I remember the first third, and after that, now everything that we're doing is kind of new to me. I don't really remember it, so. Let's see what comes next. So it's right on the D pad is lights. Okay, right on the D pad is lights for cars and also for the sub. What was weird is the sub had the lights on, but there was no light. And then when I turned them off and turned them on again, then there was light. So it must have been some kind of a lighting glitch where the sub's uh, lights weren't on, even though they technically were. And I just, re you know, did a reset and then it fixed itself. So, there you go. Yeah, left button's radio, which obviously we're not, we can't even use if we turn it on because the music's muted. So that we can actually have a playthrough people can watch and a stream that doesn't get shut down. You know, we've learned our lesson with my React content this year about the music on YouTube and how bad it is. Steal the tow truck, okay. Come on, come on. You bloody! Well, you're not stupid. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. I don't know if YouTube will ever change that for the better. Like one of the things that YouTube said it was going to do this year was we're going to have this new music system back in like January, February. And what you would do is you would register for the system. You're going to catch such a beat. This guy followed me. You'd basically be able to register for the system, hey, <clears> and if you did, then you would pay a certain amount of money to be able to use licensed you music in your, your videos. Fun. And everyone you thought this was going to be great. They're like, oh, what it'll be? Like maybe $20 a month? Can you imagine if content creators could play a flat flat fee to have music in their videos? That'd be amazing. But then they launched the system, and the system was nothing like what they explained. The system is you have to pay a per video fee. So let's say, for example, in this video there was a song, and I wanted to have that song in the video and not have it get claimed or blocked. I could pay a per video fee to license that song and have it in this video. Do you want to know what the fee was? Like $70 a song. So imagine paying 70, 80 bucks to have one song in your video. Imagine if you had a video that you edited had four songs in it. So you end up paying like four or $500 for one video. Now maybe if you're a ginormous content creator who knows you're going to get millions of views on your videos, maybe then that investment is worth it for a common person. Who in the fuck would use that, right? It doesn't make any sense at all. Like, you're out of your mind. So the entire system they created, no one uses it. They, cre they programmed and created an entire system that literally no one uses because they're just idiots who didn't ch test the market to see if anyone wanted it. No, no one's going to use that system. If it was like, okay, 20 bucks a month and you can use music in your videos, who wouldn't? I mean, if I was a content creator, I would do that. I would do it right now. I'd pay 20 bucks a month to use any music in my video. Sure, I would. And I bet you hundreds to thousands more people would do that too. Because then that means we could all play games. We could all use like music in the background. Who would want to do that? Right? And that would make YouTube a ton of money. Right? But they don't want to do that. They don't want to find like an agreement that makes sense. They want to like, you know, these stupid music companies want to make insane amounts of money. So, they're out of their fucking minds. No one's ever going to agree to that. <clears throat> Not a scratch and trucking. <clears throat> Daniel says, why did I choose to use the music in the remaster trilogy and not this? Well, there's two major reasons, okay? Oh, I have to call. Hold on. <clears throat> Tow truck is at the lot. Okay. So there's two major reasons. Reason number one. The original GTA trilogy takes place in the past, right? GTA 3 is essentially... The early 2000s. Vice City is the 80s. And then you've got uh, San Andreas, which is the 90s. When you listen to the soundtracks in those games, those take you into those time periods. You understand? Like, you feel like you're there, 
because not only does everyone dress different and act different, but you got the music for that time. It's this nostalgia, uh, this nostalgia that ties in with those games and it immerses you in that game because of that, okay? So, if I was gonna play the GTA Trilogy and I'm playing the classics, I wanna try to leave the music on if I can. Now, obviously that means problems, right? That trilogy that I played, was it two years ago? I'm not kidding you. Probably out of all the videos of that entire trilogy, maybe one-fifth was I able to make money on. Because all that music gets claimed on YouTube. So, we're talking entire months that I was playing games and I missed out on big money that I usually get at the end of the year because I decided to leave the music in. So I, I essentially shot myself in the foot for the sake of the quality of those playthroughs. Now, even doing that, I, I, I still got kind of screwed because there were entire videos that were muted or blocked, again, for having music. And it doesn't make sense. It's so dumb. What happened here? Why did it disappear? It moved. Am I, I guess I'm hunting down something. <clears throat> I don't know. But yeah, it was a hassle. I would stream and the stream would get muted. I would, I would end the stream and the video would get blocked. Now I gotta edit shit out. It was amazing. Pe it was a major pain in the ass. Okay? And it just wasn't worth, honestly, after having done it, it wasn't worth the hassle. Okay? Now, the other thing is we're playing GTA 5. This game took place in 2013. The music of 2013 is not iconic. You don't need to have that soundtrack, right? To feel like you're playing a game that's in modern times. So, I don't really feel like having the music in this game is Run. adding that much you at end up in And the if, back of considering this. the hassle that we had with the trilogy two years ago, having new videos blocked, muted, have to edit this, do that. I was like, it's just not worth it. Let's, let's just play without the music. That way every video will be visible. I won't have to fucking edit. I won't have to fucking fuck around. People can watch the videos right away without any kind of problem. And it's worked. I've not had a single problem with the video. Okay, not to say that some of the videos didn't get claimed. Do you remember the one that was fame or shame? We have to save Michael's daughter from doing the reality show. So during that, it played a Rick James song and that video got claimed. Luckily it didn't get blocked, but it got claimed, which is super annoying. Well, outside of that one video, the rest of the playthrough has been fine. So, that's a good thing, obviously. And I hope to keep that going for the rest of the playthrough. Obviously, I don't want the playthrough to get ruined with that, with bullshit. So, that's why we're keeping the music on. I don't really feel like having the music on would have added that much at this point. 20 hours in, I don't see a giant group of people complaining there's no music. So, all right, well, we need to lose the cops. How are we going to do this? Uh... See what we can do here. Man, this truck is so slow. I don't know how I'm gonna lose them. How am I gonna lose them? I'm like slightly pulling away, but not by much. Oh my God, look at the speed I got. Oh no, oh! Okay, go, go, go. Holy crap. I can hide in the tunnel. I'm gonna try hiding in the tunnel. Oh, we did it! Never mind, we lost them. Sweet. So basically, I just floored it, and because I floored it in the truck, I and I was going down a hill, I got enough momentum, I lost the cops. There you go. Good stuff.
Oops. Dude, this looks so cool driving through these neighborhoods now with the lights changing and everything. It looks so realistic. I should do Master Chief Collection. Uh, Master Chief Collection, which I played years ago. I did play it again. If you remember, right before Halo Infinite came out, I tried Master Chief Collection on Xbox Series X. I think we did like one or two streams of it. And uh, I thought it was alright. Like, I played Halo 3 and I played a couple other games in there that I used to play, and I thought it was alright. Well, I don't think I would go back to that now. I mean, Halo has pretty much fallen completely out of prominence at this point. No one's really talking about Halo anymore since Infinite tanked itself. By the way, it looks like stream chat is frozen again. How the life. If you guys are enjoying today's stream, you can do me a solid and like the stream. For 100 likes, we do that silly bubble blow. You know, the uh, <clears throat> engagement helps the channel a lot. Um, in addition, we you just consider, you know, supporting the stream in some way today, that'd be very nice of you, whether it be a super chat or a super sticker, a membership or a gifted membership or a tip. I would love by the end of today to be at 500 members. We were already there, and then we lost a bunch of the, the gifted ones that expired. So I'm trying to get back to where we were. 500 would be great. And with the amount of viewers we have today, I know that we could hit that. So if you're thinking of supporting the stream today, please consider either becoming a member or maybe gifting a membership to the community. I'm sure people would love that, especially for the upcoming events and special stuff coming up. Uh, a membership would be great, I'm sure. <clears throat> Am I going to do one ending, ending to play through or all three? I have no idea. In my first playthrough, I knew there were multiple endings, but I didn't know how to get them. I just went ahead and played it naturally. So, Okay. It's two down. Two to go. So, undented and mission time. No. We're stealing another car here. <coughs> Sanitation truck's there now, so don't you bother. I don't know why the cops are supposedly around. You hear that? I don't know who they're yelling at. They're not yelling at me. Weird. Okay, we've hit the 100 likes. Indeed we have. Thank you, guys. Let's, uh, let's do our silly bubble blow for the day. I don't know why I just went widescreen. That was pretty dumb. We're going to do an HD bubble blow for some reason. I don't know why I did that. <laughs> I was distracted. All right. An HD bubble blow for you guys. Then we'll go back to the standard webcam. Here we go. Ready? Here we go. The bubbles went everywhere. Infinite Reusion says, in my first playthrough, I did a save before the big choices at the end. So I could do all three. There's a cool Easter egg in one of the endings. I don't I don't remember the endings that I got, honestly. I really don't. And again, it's been 10 years. I remember it was a more positive ending for, like, I think it was Franklin had the positive ending. I can't actually remember the whole ending, though. All right, anyway. Let's get this back to the correct resolution. I don't know why I changed the resolution. That was silly. There we are. Okay. So thank you guys for the engagement. I appreciate that. Any other support would be greatly appreciated today. We still have quite a ways to go on today's stream. Oh, let's see here. So let's do this one, I guess. I don't even know what these are, so. Eventually we gotta find a getaway car too, right? I'm pretty sure I had the positive ending. That's the one I got, if I remember correctly. I think it's about, isn't it about the the amount of content you do in the game and then how you do the final mission or something like that? If you do so well on the final mission versus if you like suck or something. I can't remember. Dabian says MK11 beta downloadable the 15th tomorrow at 11 a.m. Eastern time. Cool. Well, guess what? Tomorrow. Uh, is Street Fighter Day. 
we're going to be doing Rank Street Fighter 6, so while I'm on the PS5, I might download the beta while I'm there. Sounds good. The positive ending is the canon ending. Gotcha. By the way, I totally forgot to check for tips. I, I'll check that in a bit. I'll check for tips in a bit, because obviously there's been some issues with the, the notifications for tips and stuff, so I'll check that in a bit once we get to this next mission objective. <coughs> Shit. <coughs> ah! Well, this guy's being pissy about it. Three boiler suits. So different boiler suits. Different colors. There you go. Franklin, Trevor, Michael. Okay. I should probably buy a uh, body armor, right? I need body armor. Where do you get the body armor from? Right here. Makes you proud <clears throat> to be American, here it is. It? Super heavy body armor. Good. All right. So while we're doing that, uh, uh let me check here. Yes, I did receive a twenty dollar tip from One Minute Man. One Minute Man with his usual support of all of my content and streams. Thank you very much, One Minute Man. Let's get you up on the leaderboard and your animation. Thank you for that. That is the biggest contribution of the day, by the way. We had a slow start today. It would be great if, again, if you guys are enjoying, if you could support. Uh, the last two main streams we did with GTA V as the daytime stream did really well. Which I was very happy for. So, I, you know, obviously I'd like to keep that up if possible. Thank you. Okay. Like a candy store for adults, isn't it? He said it's like a candy store for adults. There you go. An excellent purchase. Can I buy a soda? <laughs> Got my health back. Beautiful. Getting away the whole damn TV is fucking garbage. I hear you. Boiler suits. United Colors Quick Shopper. They really wanted me to hurry and buy them fast. I mean, it's ridiculous. Right? Okay, so we got this one left. Whatever this is, let's find out. Almost time to split the part as well. <clears throat> Boiler suits can come off the shopping list. This vehicle can be used as the getaway vehicle. Hide it in a discreet location. Ah! So it's hard to get away location option with phoning Michael. I got one more thing to do before we do the getaway vehicle, so. What's that? What's that over there? You see that? What is that? That's right, Bob. One more day, and I'm a retired man. Corn and potato chips. Morning, noon, and night. Now, what the hell? The hell happened? Help! Somebody, I'm trapped! I can smell gas! Get me out of here! Use that bulldozer to move the pipes! And hurry, please! Bulldozer? There's gas in here! What bulldozer? Hurry up! We don't have long. Where's the bulldozer? Hurry, please! I smell burning! Over here. Oh, God! I'm not gonna make it! Come on! Come on! Hurry up! We don't have long! Get back! She's gonna go! Run! It's gonna blow! 
Run, run, run! He made it. Holy shit. Thank you so much. I thought I was done for there. Is that it? That's a good deed, huh? Yeesh. Well, we saved him. I wonder if that does anything, right? I don't know. Genetic says, I'm interested in getting back into GTA. Last played Vice City, San Andreas, and 4. How's the game hold up in 2023? This is the Xbox Series X version. As you can see, it's gorgeous. Like, it's really nice. <clears throat> oh, the fire department showed up. Cool. I know, Trevor's a nice guy, supposedly, in this playthrough. I mean, he really isn't. His character totally isn't. But for some reason, you're presented with all of these, uh... <clears throat> all these options to do nice things with him. And I've done the ones that i found. A little shortcut. That reminded me of Crazy Taxi back in the day. Don't delete this isn't spam. Who's this? Gray Nicholson? Hold on. You know the guy whose bike you got back yesterday? That's me. Guess what? I'm seriously rich. Have you heard of Animal Ark, the all-natural pet store? I started that company three years ago. When I was 17 years old, now I got eight homes. Turns out organic pet food is totally recession-proof. <clears throat> it was never about the money for me. Even when I floated the business on the stock exchange, I'm totally unchanged by it. I'm a new generation millionaire. I don't believe in cynicism or working hard. Money is meaningless if you're, if you're spiritual bereft. You know what I mean. You stepped in and helped me. You didn't see a highly successful entrepreneur. So I'm sending you $100,000 of stock in Animal Ark. Okay. Do I have that now? Yeah. He sent me $100,000 of stock in Animal Ark. Should I just sell it now? Or do you think it'll go up and down? Animal Ark. What do you guys think? I don't know. I don't know, you know, I don't know what's going to happen. My other investment just tanked and I lost all my money. <clears throat> just sell it, sell it all. Hold. I don't know, do you guys know like what you're supposed to do? Whoa. What the hell? Look at tanked. Animal Arc was really high at one point and then it tanked. See that? Hold it. Hold it. A lot of people are saying hold it. It looks like it was high and then it dipped for some reason. Right? You got a good feeling about it? Yeah, you got a good feeling I'm going to lose all my money again. Right? All right, I'll hold it for now. You guys let me know what you think. <clears throat> that was random. That was for doing the good, good, the good deed, right? <clears throat> I sent you $100,000 in stock randomly. By the way, that's not how it works. You can just send someone stock. I actually have to accept it and sign it and accept responsibility for it. You can't just hand it to someone like a, like a you know, like a gift certificate. <clears throat> that's not how it works. Or else you could, be, you could give stock to children, which you can't do. What am I doing here? Three masks. Hey, you my dude, right? The green monster, the red monster, the pigs. Didn't we get the pigs last time? The skulls, monkeys, <laughs> Jason, 
Ape. Carnival, which is really like Day of the Dead. Wrestler masks. A ton of different wrestler masks. Let's buy the wrestler Just masks this time. Just keep walking. I'm glad you and that mask found each other. Here we go. Jesus, what a freak! FaceTime cliche? Huh? I don't get it. Later, Hi, Mom. <clears throat> Just to say, I got us some headgear for this masquerade balls up. All right, this is the getaway vehicle. So where am I supposed to hide this? Does it say on the map where to hide this? I don't know where to hide it. Because I don't know where the heist is. <clears throat> so how, how do I know where to put this? Does anyone know how to do this? Why don't I do ad placements and, and sponsorships and stuff? Because to me, oh, this is not about making money. This is about having fun with games, chilling with you guys, having meaningful content, and having a good time. If I can make a living doing it while I do it, that's the icing on the cake, you understand? Like, I never intended on this being my job. I never did. Like, never, not once in my life that I said, oh, I want to be a YouTuber and, and mess around on the internet. Never. Um, there's too many content creators out there. Their entire content is, is intrusive shit, shilling crap, playing games they would never have interest in just because they're getting paid to play them. I don't do that. You know, I refuse. So, anyway. How did down an alley near the heist? But where's the heist? Look, the map doesn't tell you where the heist is. So if I don't know where the heist is going to be, how do I know where to hide the, the fucking car? Right? How am I supposed to know? How dumb is that? Why does the game not tell you where the heist is going to take place? Right? Is this it? Is that it? That's the only thing I see on the map. Why would the game not tell you where the heist is? Pretty dumb. Well, let's put the part here, guys. And uh, thanks for watching. If you're continuing to watch the playthrough, remember things like liking the videos, leaving comments are helping a lot. And uh, please, please try to keep that engagement high uh, since this is a special anniversary run. I hope you guys are still enjoying it, all right? I'll be back.